Hong Kong is facing a severe inundation following the heaviest rainfall recorded in 140 years. This intense rain has led to widespread flooding in the densely populated and hilly region of China. As a response to these extreme conditions, authorities have taken the measure of closing schools and advising people to stay home. Streets, shopping malls, and metro stations have been submerged, with even the critical cross-harbor tunnel connecting Hong Kong Island to Kowloon experiencing flooding. Landslide warnings have also been issued for specific areas. The Hong Kong Observatory, responsible for monitoring weather conditions, reported a record-breaking hourly rainfall of 158.1 mm in the hour leading up to midnight, the highest since they began keeping records in 1884. The observatory has cautioned that this heavy rain could trigger flash floods, advising residents living near rivers to remain vigilant about weather updates and consider evacuation if their homes are flooded. John Lee, the chief executive of the territory, expressed deep concern about the severe flooding and has directed all departments to respond with maximum efforts. The Weather Bureau has issued the highest level black rainstorm warning, anticipating these extreme conditions to persist until at least noon, 4 o'clock Greenwich Mean Time, on Friday. This intense rainfall comes after Typhoon Haikue caused significant damage in Taiwan before crossing the strait and making landfall in China's Fujian province earlier in the week. Hong Kong's observatory attributes this torrential rain to the trough of low pressure associated with the remnants of Haikue. Southern China had already experienced the impact of two consecutive typhoons, Seola and Haikue, the previous weekend, although Hong Kong managed to avoid a direct hit. Experts point to climate change as a contributing factor, as it has increased the intensity of tropical storms, resulting in heavier rainfall and stronger winds that lead to flash floods and coastal damage.